guys, it's Vaughn, and uh, me and Tara Tara Chan are at Tutti, you guys know her, the kawaii. <laughs> We're at Tutti Fruity, and look what we got. What did you get, hun? Strawberry with, er, watermelon, dairy-free with pomegranate boba burst. Yum. And um, how much did that cost? A few cents over $3. Mine cost almost five, sad face. It was like two, I don't know. But I filled it up and I got the soybean one with blueberry boba and that. And we're going to give ours a try. What do you think of it? Love it. Let's switcheroo now. I'm not normally a big fan of watermelon, but I like how the bobas, it's a really beautiful color combination she chose. Mm. Hearty. <laughs> Random M&M &M in there. That is really good. Mm. Okay. I love soy milk. Mm. Toast. Mm. Look how the place looks like. All the chairs. We're on a swivel chair. Swivel chair. See? Excuse me. Okay, basically, it's like this, and you guys get to get whatever kind of toppings and sauces, and I got that one. There's all different kinds. I forgot to mention, I have the pumpkin pie on here. So I'm gonna we're gonna do this. Let me scoot over with our fluffy chair. We're gonna do this before we run out of stuff to eat. But I we have these ghost pepper gumballs and we have wasabi gumballs. Are we gonna give the wasabi one a try? I take one. Okay. They're really hard to chew. Mm. Ah. Ew. <laughs> what does it taste like? It definitely is wasabi. <laughs> uh, uh, I can't it's edible. It's just fathom the words to describe this. <laughs> it's not that hot, but it's still... It, it's an odd flavor. I wouldn't chew this every day. <laughs> it's an odd flavor for me. Yeah. If I'm going to eat wasabi, I'm just going to take it off of my sushi plate and eat it. <laughs> so basically, it's... It has a hint of wasabi. It kind of tastes gross, but... Spitting that out. Yeah. yeah, goodbye. Okay, and the next is the ghost pepper gumball. Oh okay, guys, it is now time to try the ghost pepper gumballs. And uh, Tara's in the I'm scared to death. Okay, you wanna take one? Excuse me. I'm gonna grab it with a napkin because I touch my face a lot and I don't want my face to touch it. <laughs> Ah, oh, bad. Okay, I'm gonna die now. Wait, let me grab mine. Okay, we're gonna do. We got our ghost pepper gumballs. Cheers. Nah. Wait, wait, we gotta see. Okay, go. All right, chew it. That tastes cinnamon. Ow! <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ow, it's hot. Hot. Yeah, but we can't do it. <coughs> uh, what do you think? That's like really hot cinnamon. Yeah, it's kind of hard to stop because 
It won't let me chew it. They're stale. This is my first time ever eating something with ghost pepper in it, just to let you know. The hottest chili I've ever had was habanero and those little tiny Asian chili. So I'm gonna die shortly after this. Well, the hottest chili I've had was a boot jalokia. Tumarine scovel. Oh well. Um. Is it chewable now? Yeah. It's not as hot, like, once you get it to a gum texture, it's not as hot, but it still burns my tongue a little. What do you think? Not as hot as I was expecting. I can still talk and I can still breathe, but I'm sure the pepper is a lot worse. <laughs> At least we don't have to swallow it. And I would probably wouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> yeah, let's get rid of it, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Good thing about this is it can get stuck in my tongue ring. <laughs> it's too stale to show them. Awesome. Okay, guys. Uh, yeah. Yeah, my jaw hurts now. Yep. <laughs> yeah, you guys stay tuned and see what we're gonna film next. Hello guys, I have this Sonoro, Sonoron, Sonoron Spice Company Ghost Pepper Gumballs, and this was a gift sent to me by Rob Dog. Thank you, you're freaking awesome. I will send you pepper soon. And let's look at the calorie count. Oh, this camera sucks. Okay, and it does contain actual ghost pepper. Okay, let's open it, shall we? Uh, can you hold this, Tara? Thank you. Okay, let's open it up. And let's give it a try. 